Apple have just brought out, well they brought it out a while ago, but they brought out the most expensive Apple Mac ever. Literally ever. It is ridiculously expensive. Everything from the stand to the screen to the actual Mac. We're talking tens of thousands of pounds here. And I want to do a video. I know this isn't a tech channel. You can think of it as a business video if you want. But I want to make this video to be a logical video. And I want to compare the most top spec Mac Pro to a custom PC which I'll build for you on this computer, right? The same spec custom PC and compare the prices. So first, before I do this, please subscribe to my channel. Most of my videos are about business. I really think you'll like them. I'm trying my hardest to get to 10,000 and I know you subscribing is gonna really help that. So please subscribe to my channel, it means a lot. And this is all part of my 100 day content challenge. So let's just let's just get right into it. By the way, the 100 day content challenge is me posting a video every day for 100 days and posting an article on LinkedIn and Quora and Medium, my website. But let's just focus on this video. The most expensive Apple Mac. And do you know what the most annoying part of all of this is? I want one. I desperately wanna buy one. But I just, I, I can't, I can't, it's it's ridiculous. So let's go through it. Here's the Mac Pro. It's, you know what, let's just have a look at it first. It's gorgeous, oh, it's gorgeous. And we're gonna spec it with two screens, okay? Because that's how I work, two screens. Oh, it's stunning, it is stunning. Okay, let's buy it. Let's buy it. Now I would actually use as well because I do a lot of video editing, but whatever, okay, so. Starts at £5,499. Let's configure it now. So, 3.5 gigahertz, 8 core. No, we need a 2.5 gigahertz, 28 core. Intel Xeon W processor turbo boost up to 4.4 gigahertz. I think that's the one we need. For all of these YouTube videos I'm editing, that's the one we need. Um, okay. Oh, the price just jumped up to 11,799. All right, memory. How much RAM do we need? How much RAM do you probably have in your computer? In this computer, I have, let's have a look. I have 16 gigabytes. They don't even offer that. It starts at 32. But then again, who needs 32 when you can have 1.5 terabytes? That's one and a half thousand gig of RAM. Who the hell needs that? But anyway, we're gonna put it in because I think we need it. That is a whopping 22 and a half thousand pound extra. Talk about upsells. The price of this is now 34,299 pounds. Right, graphics cards. We all need a good graphics card for all the gaming and the video editing and all that kind of stuff we do. We need a decent graphics card and unfortunately the, the Radium Pro 580X is not going to cut it. It's just not. So. Let's go for two Radium Pro Vega 2 Duos with two times 32 gigabytes of HBM2 memory each. That's a whopping 9,720 pounds. Still not that much, we're only at 44 grand. That's about the price of a Mercedes. Yeah, an Audi, pretty much. Okay, storage, how much storage do we need? Well, 256 gigabytes of SSD storage seems a bit sh because you're probably going to be recording in 8K if you've got this beast. So let's just ramp it up to eight terabytes, which is still not very much, but don't worry because we're gonna have a whole bunch of extra hard drives to go with this. Do we want an Apple afterburner? Well, it's only 1800 quid, so yeah, sure. It will be good for video editing, won't it? Right, we've now got that. Do we want it with the stainless steel frame with wheels or do we want feet? Well, I feel like we need to roll it from here to here, so we're gonna go with feet. Yeah, we're gonna go with feet. Now, we want the Magic Trackpad 2 and the mouse, obviously, because we need two things. And um, do we need Final Cut Pro? Nah, I use Premiere Pro. We don't need Logic. In the box, we get a beautiful mouse, a keyboard, a computer, and the power leads. And a USB-C to lightning cable. Oh, that's so sweet of them. That they, that they throw that in. Right. Let's continue. So far, we are at 48,668 pounds. We need a nano textured glass retina pro display XDR. Right, we need two of those, but I'll add that in the basket. Do we need the pro stand? This is a 949 pound stand. Do we need the pro stand? I laugh at this and I joke, but sadly, I have an illness and I want to buy this. I 
actually want to buy this, but I laugh at how ridiculous it is, but I want it. All right, we're gonna go with the pro stand because it's cool to move it up and down and stuff, so yeah. Pro stand. Do we want the visa mount to turn it sideways? Well, yeah, I feel like I do a lot of coding, don't I? So yeah, 189 pounds, that's nothing. Let's add this to the bag. Right now, we've got to add another screen. Oh, we can get essentials. Apple Care plus for the Apple display, we need that. That is important because this device, this computer is never going to move from the same place. Or actually, it has wheels, it will move. They could get scratched, we need Apple Care. Do we need a Promise Pegasus R4i32 RAID? It looks cool, what does it do? It delivers powerful RAID engine for the, R oh, this is RAID, I don't know, for the Pegasus as an internal four bay, oh, it just, yeah. Now, what else do we need? Pegasus, nah, I don't need that one. 4K Pro Magnetic Webcam, yes. For all those videos we're shooting. Belkin Lock Adapter for MacBook Pro, nah, don't need that. Do we need AirPods? To go with this, no. Let's be realistic now. How many AirPods are there? Oh, okay. Let's just review the bag. Okay, we have got ourselves a final price, but let me just quickly add a second screen. Oh, it does. It did that automatically. That's nice of them. Right. We've got one Mac. I don't need two of these. Why do I have... How? What is going on? They're just adding stuff to my basket. Okay, let's... Okay. We are at a... How many... Pre oh, no. I only need... This one. Look at this, I'm saving myself five and a half grand here just because it was in my basket. Your bag total is ba -ba -da -ba -dam, £64,350.95. That is what we have to work with when building our custom PC. Okay. Bloody hell, that's big. It includes VAT of 10,000, 10, so we'll get that off as well. But that's how much that costs. Let's go to PC Specialist. This is who I got my PC from. And by the way, I can I just say I'm a mass massive Apple fan. I like Apple Macs. The only reason I use a PC is because it's cheaper and it's very good for video editing. But like I said, if, if, if I could drop, this is now, we're now talking about a secondhand Audi R8. If I could drop that amount of money on a computer, I would. Because I'm, I, I have problems. I do. So let's just build a computer here. Custom, configure a custom PC. All right, let's do this. Do we want Intel? Uh, I think, I think the Apple one is Intel, isn't it? Yeah, I'm gonna do Intel. Okay, let's do Intel. My budget is, I don't have a budget, so. My budget is up to 20 grand. Oh gosh, they didn't even go past 20 grand. Well, this is a bit crap. All right, let's just configure the most expensive one. My budget is to 20 grand, yep. 56 core, holy crap. Okay, um, select a case. This one is four pounds more, so we're gonna go for that one. Intel Xeon Bronze six core. No, 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 no. I need Intel Xeon Platinum, two and a half gigahertz, super eight uh, thingy, 28 core. Oh, I can have two of these. I can have two processors in this machine. Holy crap, okay. Right, so let's just, there. Yeah. Let's just go to another Xeon Platinum, what, 8180, 28 core, 2.5, yeah, okay, let's do that. Motherboard, let's go for, yeah, that's the only one it's giving me. RAM, 384 gigabytes of RAM. Unfortunately, it does not let me go to 1.5 terabytes of RAM. I think I might have to get the Mac because I need more RAM. So, RAM, graphics card, let's go for their best graphics card, which is going to be, in my mind, the, um, well, 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 what's this one? Um, uh, GeForce 20, 20, 2080 Ti, that's such a pretty decent one, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so we could go for that one. 11 gigabytes, okay. Second graphics card, because like, why not? Let's just go for a whole bunch of them. So we got, um, what was it? The, uh, okay. okay. Let's go for that one again. Let's go for that one, one more time, because you know we do a lot of video editing and we need, we need this. We really need this, so. Let's just keep adding them. Oh no, I've got to add something else. All right, let's add this one. Okay. Right, storage, we need 16 terabyte Seagate. No, we want SSD, don't we? We need SSD, so let's go for two terabyte SSD. Ah, let's go for those. Let's go for another four terabyte one because we can, and it's more than the Mac at this point. 
Um, we can also go for an M.2, so we want to go for a 2 terabyte one of those. Uh, raid. Yeah, we had a raid on the other one, didn't we? So let's go for a mood volume, the exact same size. It's only £9. That's a bargain. Right, let's go for Blu-ray drive because we watch so much Blu-ray. Right, we now have uh, Corsa Air. We need to go for the best one. Sorry, that's not good enough. We need to go for a meter cable. Processor calling. Uh, that's an extra £87. Second processor calling. Let's go for another £87. Thermal paste. Yeah. LED lighting, it's got to look cool, so let's go for that. An extra case fan, yes, obviously. Sound card, we need the best possible sound card. Asus, stir, 100, yep, that's the best one. Wireless network, we need the best one. Wireless router home plugs, oh no, we, we don't need that. USB Thunderbolt options, we need, yeah, that's fine. Windows 10, this is the worst part of it. Windows 10, we don't like Windows 10. But again, this is just for editing video, photos, that kind of stuff. We're not using this as a computer to properly use. So, antivirus, it's a PC. We should probably go with antivirus. Um, one year subscription, office, no, I don't do any of that. Monitor, we need monitors. So, we need to go for a screen side, uh, 32 inch, that's a monitor we're gonna find a good monitor on Amazon right let's go for mouse now we'll find a good mouse on Amazon okay we have now done this okay proceed uh, okay I have to remove stuff I have to install yeah that's fine proceed what is our total price people First thing I just say, this is a beast of a machine. This is powerful. This is, if not more powerful than the Mac. We have got 56 cores. 56 cores! Bloody hell. Okay, this is a whopping total. What is this? £28,054. We are already saving over 30 grand. Okay, now we haven't considered the, the, the screens though. Screens are important and so is a keyboard and a mouse. Let's go to Amazon. I think the Logitech mouse is the best one. So Logitech, oh, what's it called? Logitech mouse, which one is it? It's the, here, Logitech MX Master. Let's bump in 40 pounds on top of that. Okay, so we'll open that on a new screen because we need to remember this. And on top of that, we need a keyboard. So let's just go Logitech keyboard. My, my, oh, I spelt that badly. My keyboard was quite expensive. My keyboard was 90 pounds. Um, so I'm gonna just sort by most expensive, if I can. Sort, actually no, sort by price height, it's gonna be hard. Um, that one's 70 pounds, let's just put that one in because why not? We can even have the Apple ones here. Right now, we need, um, we need monitors. So let's go for monitor, but we need a good one. We need a really, really good one. So let's put 4K in, obviously. It's gotta be as good as the Apple ones, right? Um, now we could go for those ones. No, we're not gonna go for the photographer ones. Let's go for, let's go for 4K wide monitor. Here we go, 279. Now that's not wide enough, is it? Ultra wide, 419, 449, 659. That looks good. All right, we're gonna go for two of these. All right, two of these. Ooh, that looks cool as well. All right, we're going for two of those. What is our total? Let me work it out on my trusty sidekick of a keyboard. Um, we got 659 plus 659 plus 60, let's just say 69.99. One P is gonna save us a lot of money. Plus 39.99, look at that, another penny saved. Right, plus the computer which was 28054. That's £29,481.98. And the Apple computer was £64,350.95. So let's minus 64,350.95. That is £34,868.97 more expensive for the Mac. And the PC is more powerful. It's got 56 cores. Oh, I don't know how Apple can do this. Oh, this, this total is making me feel sick. That is a comparison of an app, the most highest spec 
Apple Mac Tower to what I can spec the highest PC. Now I'm sure PC geniuses out there will be able to spec it even higher and spend even more. But the truth of the matter is you're looking at spending about 35 grand or 30 grand on the, I forgot the number now, but it was about 30 grand on the PC compared to a 65 or just under 65 grand for the Mac. I'm gonna let you make the decision. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of this. Even if you're a Mac fan, and like I said, I am a Mac fan, this is a Mac. I, I love Apple, I love Apple computers, I'm a huge Mac fan, but even if you're a Mac fan, do you see sense in spending this amount of money on a computer? Now, if you're spending this amount of money on a computer, you're probably building, creating huge films with CGI and all that kind of stuff. But let me know in the comments what you think of the two. This was the closest comparison I could do without owning the two computers. But like I said, deep down, a part of me wants to buy this computer because I know how epic it is and one day I will maybe get it. But I also know it's a massive waste of money. So um, yeah, let me know what you think of this video. Let me know in the comments down below and please subscribe. I know this wasn't really business, but if you think about it, it was a bit of business because we spoke about money. And uh, yeah, I hope you liked it. I will see you in tomorrow's video.